from Kazakhstan. And uh, let me just tell you how, remind you how, in fact, how these two men got here. Um, Alvarez actually beat the Italian Fregameni in his first bout. And now he's up against the World Championship bronze medalist from 1998, Orzas Orazaliev. And Orazaliev, by the way, had already picked up a World Championship bronze medal in 1997 when the tournament was in... Uh, Budapest, tough guy. Well, if there's any weaknesses for Alvarez, or Razaliev is the kind of man to find him out. He's a non-stop aggressive light heavyweight. But to be honest with you, this light heavyweight division has, uh, has been reasonably poor, and that's a shame. Shame for everybody. Not difficult to stand out here because it is so poor, but uh, at the bottom of the draw, we've got a uh, good lad from Russia, Alexander Levziak, the running European champion. Also got the Australian still in, Danny Green. He, he actually takes on Levziak. And the Frenchman, John Doby, still there. Round one, then. And uh, Olzas Orazialiev. Um, of course, knows all about these Cubans, and this one's a southpaw as well. Knows all about these lads, and uh, as you can see here, Alvarez nice and long-armed and tall. And he should have the talent here, I would have thought, to knock this uh, Kazakhstan out of the tournament. And if you notice how all, most of these Cubans are incredibly big for the weight division they're in. Lovely, oh, well, lovely left, uh, right, cross there, but a left hook from Alvarez. He's got him in trouble. Well, very proud man, isn't he, this, uh, this lad from Kazakhstan. But uh, no respect there at all from the Cuban who took a right cross and then landed a left hook. Well, a right getting through then, again, from Orazielia. Oh, nice left right again from Orazielia. Oh, sorry. Or as Aliyev, and now three all. You wouldn't have put uh, a pound on it being that, would you? With a few seconds to go in this opening round. But it's a quality performer, you know, this Kazakhstan. And once again, a big shot there landed, but it didn't, sca didn't score. A three from Australia. Well, good start from both men, and the Kazakh gets a 4-3 lead. <laughs> Bit of replay, here we go. Watch this again, that lovely left hand. Another very interesting round. And uh, don't forget, the Kazakh is 4 3 up. Oh, oh look at this. Well, he's got a, a quite a, a badly swollen left eye there. 
Well, interestingly, this is a major problem now for this Cuban. Alvarez has got a badly swollen left eye there, possibly from the right cross that uh, Orazi Aliyev scored before the left hook uh, caused the standing count. So he needs a knockout now. And I tell you what, he's up against a real tough handful here. And uh, if this Kazakhstani can land in a couple of more rights on that left eye of uh, Alvarez, this one could be over. So dangerous moments then for the Cuban. And uh, that's swelling not going to get any better. And again, a good right then from Orazi Aliyev. Oh, and again, a nice stiff right then. And, uh, well, this Cuban favourite looks in danger here. But, of course, one reason that the Cubans are so good at uh, boxing is how they go through the gears when they need to. I've got a feeling though that this lad is here for the duration. He's not going to go and get himself knocked out. So Orozali, I think, giving as good as he's getting, but to the Cubans, pull back now and made it five all. And again, the right through the middle from Orazeliev. And still the Kazakh has the lead now, three points. Well, it's gone to 8-6, 15 seconds to go. And uh, our referee doesn't like the look of this eye. Once again, getting the doctor up to have a look at it. Of course, the doctor can stop it. They don't like the... Yeah, that looks bad. That looks too bad for amateur boxing anyway. In a pro ring, they'd probably let it go, but uh, I don't think they let it go here. Well, he might. We'll see. Doesn't look happy. Well, let's see, see, we see out this round. Less than 15 seconds to go now. And uh, unfortunately, he's in with a real tough guy here, Alvarez. And uh, any sign of a knockout, I think he can forget about. And needs to get rid of him, really, doesn't he? So wonderful. Ra Oops. Well, the left hand right on the bell. And a standing, I can't believe it. Oh, left cross on the bell there. And uh, against the run of play, against the run of play there, the Kazakhstan found himself on the floor. Well, the bell has come up to end round two. Oh, he's got a, he's got a public warning. He's got a public warning. Well, I, I don't know if that was right for a late blow. Goodness, we've got it all here, haven't we? We've got it all going on here. Unbelievable. Simple fact is, though, there's no way, unless they can perform a miracle in that corner, that uh, Alvarez is going to get through this one. They are, that's the right hand again from Oraz Aliyev. And that's the knockdown. Well, here we go then. Round three, halfway point. I still reckon that left eye of Alvarez is going to cause him problems in this one. And as you can see, it's 11-6 against him. Five points he's got to make up. Very difficult task. And he's just proved in the, at the end of the previous round that he can hurt Oroz Aliyev. So uh, looking for the knockout. But of course the big problem for him now is that Oroz Aliyev is steeled against it. But can he prevent it landing? Once again, the referee looking at that eye. 
Well, box on. By amateur boxing standards, that's a, a let off, I think, for Alvarez. Well, six points behind. Well, once again, I think this is the last inspection coming up. Well, they couldn't help it in the corner. It's all over, I think. Yes, it's all over. So there you are. A big upset. Alvarez of Cuba stopped in round three. And the Kazakhstani gets himself a place in the quarter final. What an upset that is. And you don't see too many Cubans beaten, do you? Let alone on a cut. Oh, well, a, a swelling, I should say. Well, 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 what a shame for him. And uh, devastated by that loss. Devastated. But, yeah, that's boxing. And uh, he looked a very strong... candidate for a quarter-final place. So third round stoppage then, loss against Alvarez. Not happy about that, naturally. What a shame. But uh, that's boxing, as I say. And, uh, you know, don't take it away from uh, Oraza, Oraz Aliyev. He's a good boxer. Good boxer, don't you worry about that. Yes, and uh, the Cuban gets a big hand, naturally. Too well there. It was just unlucky. Just unlucky. But we're still losing. Don't forget, he was still...